a 1966 Galaxy, it's just had a whole heap of restoration work done on it. It drives absolutely beautifully. It's got the PA Falcon um, big brake kit on the front, disc brakes on the front, uh, popper stoppers. It's about $6,000 worth of repairs done on it. Transmission repairs, suspension on new shockers and bushes. And, um, the engine's been, had a lot of work done to it as well. Uh, 394V big block, FE block. Took the modern radio out and stuck this period CB in. It works all right. It's, I haven't got a CB antenna for it. I didn't want to cut any holes. At the window. She runs so well. It's freezing today, three degrees. What a beautiful car indeed. All well, tyres, the rear tyres are 80%. Lovely twin exhaust. FE big block sound absolutely amazing. Best sounding V8 I reckon. This car's really, really straight. Paint's got a couple of blemishes in it. Apparently it was painted uh, in 1996. Um, the last time it was painted. There's a tiny bit of rust showing up here through as well. Um, the windscreen was done a couple of years ago, 18 months ago, and uh, underneath here it is absolutely flawless. There's no rust, nothing. The car apparently when it was new had a vinyl roof. Engine is beautiful to say the least. Uh, a lot of brand new parts, brand new dual pattern cam and lifters and timing chain from Rollmaster, brand new 600 Holly carburetor with electric choke. I've done this engine to look like a 65, an old school big block, and um, bought another one so I could get this you know, external oil feed and rounded rock covers, and I've done it to black and uh, black and gold because um, I reckon they just look head and shoulders better. Um, you can sort of see under there as well. Um, guards and uh, behind the radiator support panel are painted body colour. I reckon it looks a lot better. Um, and the firewall in the original satin black. It's also got all the sticker kit and all that. There's the original air cleaner there under the bonnet looks nice and fresh as well. Uh, Paul Walker Racing Transmission Cool. I've kept the transmission cooling out of the radiator um, to preserve the transmission. This headlight needs replacing. It's gone a bit smoky, um, so that'll be replaced, of course. It's pretty difficult to see, but there's been a lot of work done under there too. It's lovely and clean. Dry as a bone. Absolutely lovely. We've even gone to the uh, length of getting the proper plated bolts for it down the back there and brand new heater core, the heater core was re -cored. Um every brake line in the car has been replaced as well um, I've gone for dual circuit brakes, it comes with an 8.5 inch dual booster dual diaphragm booster that's not fitted um, it's got the original booster but it also runs the vacuum tank as well a lot of the parts for this car came from Dearborn Classics in the USA also, I forgot to mention, it's got an igniter electronic ignition in it as well. As you can see, I've got a bit to do in here. Here's a running engine stand with a Wolseley, uh, pre-war Wolseley motor on it. Um, and that's the car I've got to get going now. Here's a, another 390 big block. This is the one I bought. Um, which I took a lot of the bits and pieces out for the Galaxy. Um, this was a 65, so it had the rounded covers and all this, and this is all the stuff that was originally on it. The Galaxy motor was originally um, a two-barrel, but it has the big heads. I think the heads have been uh, replaced sometime in the past. This is an original 4V390 motor, and the uh, ports are much smaller than what's on the Galaxy at the moment. This motor is not included uh, in the sale of the car. The only job I haven't done, which I was going to, was replace the carpets. They don't look great. They're, they're clean and, and so forth, but I just wanted new ones. And the seats could do with a bit of a wash, um, but otherwise the upholstery is in pretty good condition. And same with the headlining. I put a new lock cylinder and coated it to the original key. Oh, there's my daughter's birthday presents. Boot's nice and clean. Um, spare wheel. There was a subwoofer box up here, which I've gotten rid of, to put the spare back up there. Um, 
And yeah, it, it's clean and functional. Original wheels, these uh, the original Galaxy wheels wouldn't fit over the uh, new big brakes. So these are the front ones are EF Falcon wheels um, with the original hubcaps. They all look nice and kosher um, to to uh, give it that stock standard look. These tyres on the front of course are brand new, they're exactly the same as the rear ones. Um, and there is our beautiful Galaxy. Also included uh, is a full receipt file. There's some things in here that probably shouldn't be here, but there's all the receipts of um, parts and so forth that were bought for the car. There's also in here, I'm just trying to find it now, there's also, I can't find it, where is it? Oh, there's also a full um, account of its service history um, going back to about 2006, um, previous owners, um, running total of all the parts that were bought and also a diary, day-to-day -day diary of when things were commenced um, and every bit of work that's been done on the car um, and totals as well. So there's a lot of material that goes with the car. So that's it, just about to stick the old beast on eBay. Righto then, see you later.